And now let's send you to Chris Berman in our studios in Bristol for the ESPN Halftime Report. Boomer? All right, Dan, we'll get back to you in a bit. But welcome, everybody, to the ESPN Halftime Show. I'm Chris Berman. Now we'll look at our halftime comparison. And as you can see, Total Yards definitely tell the story thus far. The Jaguars are winning because of it. Let's see if they can keep up their dominance in the second half. We'll start this one off late in the first quarter. Fred Taylor would make the first guy miss. Then he'd rip off a chunk of yardage here. A 28-yard play that set up a Jaguar touchdown. The Jaguars get the first points of the game and go up by seven. Chargers later on in the second quarter. The Chargers inside the red zone. Donovan Darius shows some great awareness here as he gets himself into position to pick this one off. The Jags late into the second quarter. Jags up by seven. Byron Leftwich would drop back and deliver a strike on this one. They're now up by 14. Chargers still late in the half. Phillip Rivers connected with his man on this one. Bolts losing 14 to nothing. Byron Leftwich is back to throw as they want to air it out here. And this one is right on target. And that's where we'll leave this one. Bolts are down at the half, 14 to nothing. Time now for our Halftime Hero Award, which recognizes the most dominant player of the first half. Duh. This time, there can be no question. Byron Leftwich has taken over this game. So that'll do it from here. Let's send you back out now to Dan Stevenson, Peter O'Keefe. Dan? 